Hi, I'm Chris Kochner, and I'm from Wahoo. And I'm a sophomore. Um, just a warning that my poem does reference some self-harm. And my poem is called, When You See Me. When you see me, you see my smile, and my eyes glistening in the sunlight. When I see you, I see the pain and the emptiness behind your eyes. I see the quiver, uh, quiver uh, of your lips as you try to hold your so-called smile. I see how your eyes don't smile with your cheeks and how you look at yourself in the mirror with a disgusted face. When you hear me, you hear my giggles and the jokes I tell. You hear the tone of my voice change just like the seasons. But what you don't hear is the distinct screaming of my head fighting an ongoing war with anxiety. You don't hear my depression yelling at me to stop because I'm worth nothing and nobody cares. I'm nothing. I am nobody. When I hear you, I hear the shakiness in your voice as you try to speak up so the teacher can hear you. I hear the forceful laughs and the quiet sigh of exhaustion. Nobody else notices as they laugh at you for crying. You have made yourself believe that no one notices. You have caved yourself into a bubble of isolation, being suffocated by your own thoughts and the well-known voices of negativity. You have been informed that it is all in your head and you know that, but you can't seem to stop listening. You believe what you hear. All the voices screaming in the back of your head telling you, to, telling you that you aren't worth a penny all your friends are out of pity. As you're sobbing on your bedroom floor, you feel the scratchiness of the long-lived carpet, re remembering the scratches you carved into your own flesh to feel something. You got what you expected. The stinging of your arm as you drag that blade across your skin, the warmth of the blood dripping to the floor, and the excitement of the adrenaline rush rushing throughout the body you hate so much. You feel alone, ashamed worthless. You dread each day hoping to take your last breath. Classes are sluggish and slow. You feel as if peers are giving you mean looks and talking about you. You hide your pain with a smile and long sleeves that hide your arms. No one will know as long as you're happy. No, you believe no one notices, but you pull me aside and as you grip my wrist, you realize the lifted rough lines hid under my sweatshirt. And for once, you notice you aren't alone. You cry from relief as you start to understand that there is help.